Hello, this is Laptop Media, and today, we will show you how to open the MSI Katana 17 and what's inside of it. To access this notebook's internals, you need to undo 13 Phillips head screws. Then, pry the bottom panel with a plastic tool and lift it away from the chassis. Please remember, it would be of great help to us if you just hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. That would motivate us to make even more and better videos for you. Inside, we find a 53.5 watt hours battery pack. It got us through 6 hours and 30 minutes of web browsing, or 5 hours and 30 minutes of video playback. To remove it, unplug the battery connector from the motherboard, and undo the three Phillips head screws that keep the unit attached to the device. Memory-wise, there are two SODIMM slots, which support up to 64GB of DDR5 RAM in total. As for storage, you get two M.2 PCIe X4 slots, which fit Gen 4 SSDs. However, you might need some additional hardware to install the second SSD. In terms of cooling, the laptop features four heat pipes shared between the CPU and the GPU. In addition, three heat sinks and two fans take care of heat dissipation. Lastly, there is one heat pipe dedicated to the VRMs, and one for the graphics memory. If you'd like to see more disassembly videos of the latest notebooks we would highly appreciate if you hit the like button and subscribe to the channel.